It is like seven in the morning. I'm exhausted, but Hurricane Milton is on the way. And I'm gonna give you guys live updates. This is present and right now. You may be wondering what happened with last week's hurricane vlogs. Last week's hurricane, was, it was just a simple tropical storm. This, this is like possibly gonna hit us out of category four. I'm low key freaking out. So let me get ready because we're going shopping. Alrighty, so I am ready. This is my hurricane look. All right. So that whole entire time I wasn't recording. I thought it was. Anyway, the reason why I'm dressed like this is because it's been raining nonstop since yesterday and it's gonna rain for the rest of the week. So I gotta put on a jacket, dress comfy. When it's raining like this, I just want a comfy day. Um, I need to get Dahlia ready now. So we're about to go do that. What today's game plan is to prep for the hurricane. It's a Monday. It's not supposed to hit till Wednesday. So I'm going to BJ's. If you guys don't know what BJ's is, BJ's is like a Sam's Club. If you guys don't know what a Sam's Club is, Sam's Club is like a Costco. If you don't know what a Costco is, Costco is a store where you buy things in bulk. So I'm going to get a few things from there and I'm going to head to our local supermarket here, Publix, and grab a couple other things. Probably a Publix sub because I don't mind. I've been getting really addicted to them. It's so um, definitely getting me a Publix sub because they're so good now. Now they're good. I don't know what happened. So, oh, that was Orion. I thought that was Yodi or Zelia crying for a second, but that was Orion. I'm going to show you guys Orion. My dog. You ready? All right, let's go with this. All right, so I got Celia's breakfast done. She, I made her some delicious mini pancakes. Okay, now I am making me something to a little morning, morning breakfast drink to get life going. I'm exhausted, but all for this hurricane, man. All for this hurricane. It is a little nerve wracking that I am tackling this hurricane all by myself and my house by myself, but that's what makes an independent, strong woman. I can do this with no man. And so I'm excited for the challenge and these types of challenges sometimes makes me nervous, but guess what? I'm okay not steering away because it's going to show growth and it's going to help me grow in the end. So I love all that. Honestly, growth right now is my thing for the year. Growing to be a better person, growing to be a mature person. So, and I've been told I'm doing a fabulous job. I'm getting so ahead and people are pretty impressed where I'm, I am in life without Xavier's father. Because a lot of people thought I wouldn't be able to get anywhere, but... I proved a lot of people wrong and I'm proud. So the next thing I'm gonna prove wrong, I'm gonna take on this hurricane all by myself with my daughter and Orion. But I gotta get ready. So I'm gonna go to hit up these supermarkets. Cause now at this point I'm really late. And y'all know how these Floridians be. They be crazy. I don't know why God created us this way. So let's see how much mayhem. Once again, this is recorded in real time. It is October. 7th, 8th, I don't know, 2024. <laughs> what president it is? Reagan. <laughs> Someone in the comments, do you smell toast? <laughs> okay, am I having a stroke or something? Maybe, maybe. But anyway, you guys, we're getting ready. We're gonna pack up the car and head out. What I need for sure, and you guys are gonna remind me and watch me look back and be like, I forgot. I need baking powder, baking soda, not powder, baking soda and oats milk for sure. And I need to pump gas. And I need to get Orion's food before all this man happens. But other than that, we're doing pretty good. We have plenty of water here. 
Um, I'm charging our electronics. I need to download a few movies, things like that, just to make sure, you know, if electricity goes out, there's no internet, I at least have something to watch. Make sure Zelia's tablet is all good to go as well. So we can ride this out. I'm gonna get us plenty of food, snacks. Like, I'm kind of excited because this is not Zelia's official first hurricane. There have been other, but just her that she's more aware of. I'm excited. I don't, it's just gonna be me and her like having like a hurricane party. And I love it. And this is how I see a lot of our things that we approach. Like, I don't know, I'm doing this with my bestie. We're Gilmore girling life right now, right? Don't you guys like that? We're Gilmore girls. Ah! Every day our bond grows stronger and stronger. So I think I'm doing a pretty decent job. That little girl makes me so happy. Just looking at her, just, I'm like, wow, I accomplished so much. And she has definitely been the reason why. Alrighty guys, so I got the call. Let me stage my phone i got the call from my bff who we're both going grocery shopping together mom supporting mom so love it get our kids all riled together and go like play together while we go shopping so now if you guys saw my last vlog you seen me organizing my bff's pantry that i posted yesterday if you guys haven't seen it check it out you guys are gonna love you know our relationship our dynamics she means the world to me and she's perfect you're perfect bestie. She always watches my vlog, so I love the support. <laughs> anyway, uh, she was just here a few days ago and cleaned my whole dishwasher, guys. I didn't know you had to clean the dishwasher. So I'm officially done. It's all clean. I got all the dishes out. These are clean. Um, now I'm gonna throw this baby in there. And wash my dishwasher officially. I'm a big kid now. Oh wait, there's still a few things. Before you officially wash it, and what I'm using is like a dishwasher cleaner. So put it in there, you gotta make sure all the dishes are gone in. Voila, let's get to washing. Since we're gonna be out, it's a perfect time for this to go. So my friend says she's on the way, so we are gonna skedaddle right now. All right, so so far looking at everything, it's not too hot, but this is the bulk store, so. You know, people don't go too crazy unless it's water. So we're definitely gonna go check out the water. But um, probably at Publix, it's a lot worse. So many people, so little time. Yes, you gotta shop until you drop at this time right now. All right, so majority of the water has disappeared. <laughs> Thank goodness me and Zaya have plenty of water. I did talk to Paul's parents and ask them if they needed anything. They said they're good, so I'm happy about that. Always want to make sure my in-laws are okay. Zaya's grandparents are taken care of. It's important. My parents are good as well, so we are on track. So everyone knows before a hurricane, you gotta pump gas. Why? I could not tell you why, but it's like a general rule. So we're pumping gas, and my bestie's over there also pumping gas with me. All right, so we are back in the car. I was able to pump gas. We are good to go. So now we're going to our next destination, to Publix. Right, Zelia, are we ready to go to Publix? Yeah, she loves Publix. Cause she knows, what do you get at Publix? You guys learned it? A cookie. Oh, you're so cute. At Publix, they do give out free cookies to the kids. So, Zelia loves that. So, this one over here, whenever we pass by Publix or we're in Publix, we gotta go to the bakery section. This girl is a cookie monster. Like, I'm not even kidding. She loves her cookies. <laughs> okay. Ah! 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 Not this time. Ah! Ah! Yeah, that's so sweet. She's amazing. Oh, I gave birth to such cuteness. Hey, my friend already just told me that friend, how dare I call her friend, my bestie told me that she's already getting updates from her friends, family members 
and they're telling her that yeah they're struggling to find bread already usually the first things in a hurricane to go out are bread and water so what do you think is getting knocked out right now bread and water so we have to go handle that and i have so much work guys i actually have a lot of collaborations contracts to do but when a hurricane like this comes it's just not easy like right now i have to run to the stores and make sure i'm prepared and all stocked up but thankfully i just got to think about me and zaya it's just two people so we're doing pretty good so probably put some bottles of water in the deep freezer so i have some frozen water too to help keep the cool stuff cool so fun little tricks that you learn over time while living in florida so I'm gonna do that. I'm excited. Like, um, a couple things I have to get on, done online, vlogs for you guys that I know you guys are gonna love and appreciate to see how we are handling this hurricane. What kind of name is Hurricane Milton? Not not for like possibly a category four hurricane. I would expect like, what's a category four? Axel. That's a, that's a category four name kind of right there. Axel, Hurricane Axel, ready to cut us down oh man yo i should create slogans for some of these hurricanes <laughs> come on that would have been good okay irma hurricane irma oh wait no Ooh, i was about to curse <laughs> hurricane irma the bee that went beyond <laughs> just saying cheesy stuff like that makes me laugh come on mom jokes are hilarious right zalia you just said no Alrighty guys, so we are here officially at Publix. I did record previously, but guys, for some reason today, my finger's not working. I don't know how to record. Cause then I record and I don't record and I thought I recorded, so this is like my third time re-recording. Tongue twisters, you don't want to check out the bread? Oh, I meant the fresh baked bread. <laughs> the high-end bread. <laughs> and I'm bougie. <laughs> I need that Cuban bread. No one's eating it right now. You don't see how your kids devour it? He's testing my taste buds. As you guys can see, water is practically non-existing. You got the fancy water, but eventually the fancy water will be going to like this. this. This is still heaven. That's good. You don't want the water that's like, I don't even know what that is. Maybe that's water? spend a hundred dollars on water bottles. Ooh, girl. Be fancy. Why is so expensive? Be fancy. Is that the one that comes in a glass? No, that's a boss. Girl, look at you for the hurricane living that high life. That's what I like. Yes. For a hundred dollars, I think the drinking Coca-Cola is where it's at for me. <laughs> People are still lining up for it though. What about Fiji? Fiji's Good. I mean, three That's why I'm like, maybe. <laughs> Was it exactly? Should we ask if there's more in the back? Maybe. Cairo. Okay, you gotta wait. We'll get you your cookie, but you gotta wait. Rayleigh, leave that alone. Child, leave that alone. I love you guys. So, usually when a hurricane happens, us Floridians, you know, we kind of unite. Our craziness comes together and we try to help each other out. Le yeah, every man for themselves. You're gonna see people at the beach, you're gonna see people tubing through the streets. It's the Floridian way. It's the American way. No. I just having a lovely lady like here in our conversation. We're like, there's no water. And she's like, go check out Target. Target death. Yes, Prince. Yes. Whoa, look at you have a Mickey Mouse shirt. Yes. Who got you that shirt? Mommy. Oh, did you say thank you to mommy? Thank you, mommy. <laughs> he remembered you got him that shirt right now while we're shopping. <laughs> oh, the Mickey Mouse shirt. Oh, oh, he's thanking you for it. So, lady told us they definitely have water in Target to go check it out. But by the time we get there, who knows? But we'll see. Let's see how this goes in here. Well, I had fabulous news, guys. Oh, I was just like, my bestie went one direction, I went another. Whoops, hi. Oh, and plus the girls want a cookie. You want your cookie? We gotta wait until what mommy says, and then we'll get you your cookie. I throw mommy under the bus. So we still have bread! We have a lot of bread. This is a lot. Okay. My friend is just like, you need to live the frugal life. This is rich people bread. 
And she's right. This is witch people bread. But I'm still gonna buy some. So we and this is so nice and warm still. I'm gonna bite two actually. I'm gonna bite two actually. This bread is so scarce. Um, I feel like buying two is a good idea. Because these kids eat the bread while we're shopping too. And it's still warm. I love it. Yeah. Let me see what else we got here. It's not a lot. I'm trying to think do I want to do sit up, make burgers? I'm probably gonna make burgers. I'm a burger gal. Let's see. Which one do I want? French hamburger buns or organic? Yeah, I don't want organic. You want a sprinkle cookie? All right, give me one minute. Let me finish shopping. And when JJ and Kyra are ready, we're going to go get them a cookie too, okay? We'll come back. Don't worry. We'll come back. So, give me a minute, guys. These are the cookies they're talking about. They're free cookies for kids right there. So, we usually get, get them one. And I love it. I feel like more supermarkets should be doing it. I feel like I need to get something else. What is that? Ooh. Deli meat? Do I want deli meat? Ooh, I may get some. So my bestie doesn't let the kids have any electronics, no TV. I love it. No screen time. She wants to watch this TV. Yes? This is a TV. You think that's TV? Anything that they see with the TV, they get excited for. So she's asking me to watch TV. It's, my friend is an amazing mother. Like, I mean, she raises these kids fabulously. Her four-year-old daughter is reading already. She's doing fabulous. I am amazed. Oh, look at they have buy one get one. I should tell Publix also has buy one get one. So it makes these types of situations also easier. I mean like ooh they have Elvita. Zadia has started getting into mac and cheese so this is perfect. So something else Publix has I'm looking for it which I love like they just really care for their kids. For the parents, for the kids. So they leave some fruits and veggies here, mainly like fruit, bananas, apples, oranges. So the kids have something else to munch on. And once again, my friend is an amazing mother. She has trained, not trained, but shown her kids before having any types of sweets, we need to focus first on having fruits and veggies. So they know this. Her daughter and her sons are like, they want fruit so badly before they jump into um, a cookie. Imagine we just came from the cookies and I told her, oh, we have to wait. And she's now excited to have a banana. She'd rather have a banana. I love it. I love it. As you guys can see, they're enjoying their bananas. And then I love my bestie. Oh, at least the water here is buy one, get one. So that's oh, a- those are buy one, get one. Oh, these at least? That's not bad. I need more potatoes. Thank you for reminding me. Alrighty, guys. We got plenty of stuff here. That's my friend's stuff. And then this is my stuff. Ready for the hurricane. We were very productive. It's like not even like 10 o'clock. We left the house early. We got stuff done. Water is like nowhere to be found. But by tomorrow, there's definitely not gonna be any water and no bread. And guess what guys? I got a loaf of bread. So that should be good. I would get two, but I like it fresh. So tomorrow when I come back out just to get a public stuff, I'll see if there's any Cuban bread left out and about and grab some and there you go. You guys hear a lot of screaming. My BFF took all the kids, all the toddlers, to the bathroom. I have the baby here. Baby's here. They're all screaming. They're coming all out. Here they come. It's like a, a school of fish. Alrighty, so we are officially donezo. We are done getting everything we needed to get. I just need to get Orion's food. And from there. I think I'm good. I may want to get a few more snacks for Zadia tomorrow, depending on how I stock up the house, how everything looks, what's left that needs to be bought. But I think I'm pretty good. I think we're good. We're decent. So guys, this is the first part of Hurricane Milton. Just the preparation. Let's see how even more Cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs tomorrow gets. But we are set. We're good. And we are gonna be ready to hunker down something new like this happens i do embrace it with open arms because it's a new challenge it's something i get to do by myself with my daughter and just in that thought it gives me strength to be like i got this i can do anything by myself so i got this with me and zelia we're gonna give more girls life happily because sadly it's just me and her that 
we know we can be there for each other. We're consistent in each other's lives. We're always there for each other and it's okay. It's just me and her taking on the world and I'm okay with that because I want her to know that mom was always strong at, since the very beginning and mom will always be strong even at the end. And I want her to see what it is to be happy and being able to self, you know, give yourself self love. And I think in the future she's going to appreciate it because I want her to see that mom was able to always stand up for herself and be able to advocate even in a relationship and say I don't like the way I'm being treated and it's not acceptable and it's okay to walk away so sometimes it is that I'm like I'm strong I can do this and as long as I have my daughter by my side that's all the encouragement and power that I need to keep going imagine I am the example to her of what it is to be a strong independent woman and I want her to have a clear and positive view of that and I think she's getting that a lot of people are telling me she's getting that so that's good this is where we ended but stay tuned there's so much more to happen and to come do not forget to like share and subscribe it truly means the world to us and also don't forget to check out our merch store it helps supports us and supports our adventures and helps us keep going and motivates us to see that you guys are encouraging our journey which we love and want to say thank you all right guys i didn't finish for saying goodbye so this is where we ended for now adieu and goodbyes till the next hurricane